Hello and welcome to my video giving you health, beauty and wellness tips. And I'm Melanie, I'm a beauty and holistic therapist and I'm owner of The Mellow Room. So today I'm going to show you how to do a facial exfoliation. So normally you would use um, your favourite facial scrub. So my favourite product and one that we use at the salon is the Purifying Facial Polish, which is by Circaroma. It's an organic scrub. It's got tiny little ground up pieces of walnut shell um, in a nice creamy base consistency texture that you apply to your skin. It smells of patchouli and it's really gentle yet very effective at exfoliating the skin. And you would use this ideally two or three times a week. But today I will show you how to make your own face scrub using stuff that you would have in your kitchen cupboards. Okay, so it won't be quite as effective as that one, but it will still be effective. Um, and you'll be using fresh ingredients, so you won't be keeping this one, you'll just be using it for this exfoliation and that will be it. So, we will be using some of the refined oatmeal that we've used before. Um, and caster sugar. So I would say about 75% refined oatmeal mixed in with 25% caster sugar. Then you mix it up with some plant oil, so olive oil is fine, or your favorite face oil that you have. Um, if you're using just normal plant oil, you can pop some essential oil in there, a drop of essential oil to make it smell nice. Orange is lovely. And then, to make it that sort of creamy consistency, so you could use it just like this, but to make it that really nice creamy consistency, we're going to use natural yoghurt. So just a tiny bit of natural yoghurt, which is also good for making your own face masks and things as well. Um, so, if you pop a tiny bit of natural yoghurt in a dish, and then we will add some of our sugary oatmeal product in here. And that is what you will end up with. Okay, so you will have already cleansed your skin using your oil cleanser that I've shown you how to do or your oatmeal cleanser or your normal facial cleanser. And then And we will take some of our homemade scrub. And apply that to the skin. And the sugar granules are nice and soft. They're not too sharp because we're using caster sugar. Uh, the oatmeal, again, is very gentle. Um, because we're using the creamy base of the yoghurt. It would feel a bit sharper if we weren't using the yoghurt. And then when we add a tiny bit of water, you will find that the little sugar granules start to melt on the skin, but it's really nice. It's a very, very gentle scrub, so it is suitable for all skin types. So ideally, you should exfoliate your skin every sort of three days, I would say. If you're using a very, very gentle scrub, you can do it every other day. But you should be exfoliating at least a couple of times a week. Um, it's important that you exfoliate because that's what keeps your skin looking good. Um, we're constantly shedding skin cells all the time so exfoliation is a key thing um, if you don't exfoliate properly your facial products your face serums and your face moisturizers they're just not going to penetrate the skin properly and also your skin can look dull and lifeless whereas if you're exfoliating on a regular basis it will look glowing and it will be healthy 
and it will feel so much better. Okay, and then we will use our cloth with warm water to remove. Um, everyone should exfoliate, not just women, men should as well. Um, we hope to do a video that will show a bit more about um, men's exfoliation and shaving. A lot of men get problems with like a shaving rash um, and almost like mild folliculitis from shaving where they get lots of little block pores and pimples around the skin. So I'm going to try and cover that as well. Obviously, using um, a different model for that video, so we might do that next week. Um, but yes, everyone should be exfoliating their skin. And if you're going to use a face mask or do a face massage, it's always better to do that after an exfoliation as well. And then again, I finish with putting the cloth under really cold water and just pop that on the skin as well. So if you're doing this one with the yoghurt, obviously just do it as a one-off. Don't keep it, you could keep it in the fridge for a few days, but I would just make a small amount and use it. Um, and let everyone in your house use it. And that is how to do a very simple face scrub. Okay, so I will see you again soon for another video. Um, just to update you, my online shop is now open. So please have a look at the website. Um, all the stuff on there is amazing. We're, we're getting new stock all the time. Um, we're going to be getting some handmade soy candles, some bath salts, um, and all sorts of new things appearing. But have a look at what's already on there and message me if you want details about anything. Um, and I'll see you again for another video soon. So take care. Much love. Bye.